Ahoy! Uh, Kumba versus Zeus. We don't see Zeus at all. This is like the first time I've dueled against Zeus this split, at least. I might have fought him on PS4 last split. Maybe. Or a split before that. I don't know. But yeah, so we're Kumba, as requested from the people of Twitch chat. Uh, I don't really know how this matchup goes. At all. But I decided to go blink. It might be a little tough trying to get my way into uh, Zeus, even though he is stationary, but between his throwing out a shield, getting a lot of distance damage, and the slow from his one, uh, it might be a little tough getting in there, so I'm gonna go with Blink. Blink Kuma is always a thing. Uh, Zeus should have the better clear. As you see, he does. <laughs> so we're gonna have to go ahead and go back and get here. Try your boy Jing Chen. I uh, think I played Jing Chen earlier. Not earlier today, but yesterday. So he's just getting the smalls. I had a doubt he can get the big one too. Yeah. Ah. So that's one thing you can't let Zeus keep. Ah, oh, fuck me. Basic attacking you when you have that debuff on you. He does a shit ton of damage. Ah, uh, fuck, man. I, I keep popping these chalices way too early. Ooh, what do we got here? Vamp Shroud. Um, don't know why. It gives you physical protection. I'm a magical. And then he's like, well, let's go Void Stone, which gives me magic protection. Or him, magic protection. So I don't know if he knows what he wants in his life, you know? We all kind of go through life, ah, oh, fuck off. Not knowing what, you know, you really want. This Zeus is one of them. I definitely think he should have went the Sands of Time. If not Sands, maybe, alright, uh, maybe Soul Stone. But Vamp Shroud? I don't know, man. I don't know, you don't really want to get items in, unless you can use the entirety of it. Oh! Well, it's looking a little stormy over here. Is he low HP at least? No, he's happy. See, with going the four mana pots, I was hoping to outlast them and then get uh, red buff off of that, but we pushed the wave a little bit under the tower. It's going to take him a little bit longer to get back to the lane since he doesn't have boots, so. He's gonna miss out some gold from the minions going under tower and get some a little bit of tower damage. Did I win a Jing Chen? Ah, my nose. I don't remember. It might be on YouTube. I forgot who I fought as Jing Chen. I fought someone. Alright, Kuma has like one of the shittiest jungle clears of all guardians. Sad but true. Well. We're definitely not going to have any killing potential on him since once he gets his finish, going to give him uh, 70 magical power. Protection, rather. So, no early game kills. A lot of poke, though. Game like this, you just kind of have to hold out to late, of course. Uh, oh! Yes! Okay. Sally, I have to back. Even though I don't want to, I kind of have to. We're going to CDR boots. Try to spam out as many abilities as we can possible. But if he's the kind of guy to do some weird ass shit like this, he might pull out some more weird shit later on. We'll see. I wish this did more damage. Did 86? Yeah. All right, now we got four points to the one. We can actually clear a little bit better here. Well, obviously, but there's a big difference between three points and four points. You got the blue. What's kind of keeping us in this is uh, pushing the entire wave underneath. Oh, okay. Maybe I can do this. Yeah. If it's just a single target, not worth using your two for it. It has a very long wind-up time and very, very little payoff. You can voice still completed. Interesting strat. I guess he assumes because you know I have to be like really close up to him, he's gonna be able to benefit from it. So I wanna see. Have some fun. How are you feeling, bud? Alright. He didn't even want to look at me. He just kinda just turned around and took it. Alright, now that that's gone. See our clear is a little bit better there. Don't wanna be in that either. Boy. 
What's our ultimate? Now that's nice. Scales down to 49. That's with 20% CDR. It's looking good. Oi. Oh yeah. Kind of hurting for uh oh Jesus for damage. 300. I see you. He's gonna go for red buff. Unfortunately, can't do anything about that. Going to Genji's here. So, I'm not really thinking about going to double, all right, double magic protection. They're gonna go for more of a burst. So we go Genji's, Obshard, probably E-Staff, Polly, Rod Tweety. That's the plan there. He smalls up at least? No, nothing's up. You got the red buff, of course. Hello? What's up? More experiments here. Seeing how much damage we do. Eh. You wanna hear a weird screechy sound? I hope not. In static? Um, uh, probably. I don't know. What you need is mystical mail. Um, if only if it gave magic protection. But, still, mystical mail Kuma doesn't really mix too well. You will never really be able to utilize the full effect of your mez as far as when it comes to putting them to sleep. It wake them right back up, which is alright because, I mean, not really alright in this matchup at least, but if they get out early, they are slowed and have an attack speed debuff. And slows are alright, but sometimes you might just want to, you know, put them in night-night time, you know what I mean? Give them some love there. Feels bad. Yeah, that's why we need more CDR so we can use our one to poke and have it up to clear at the same time. So he's feeling a little frisky. He knows I'm coming. <laughs> All right, I knew he uh, was gonna try some shit like that. More experiments. All right. Your gold for for tell me that was mad that I miss. Oh Jesus, hello Zeus. It's the power of the pin boots there. Ooh. Man, I I really dislike Kumba's too a lot of the time. Oh well, let's get the fuck out of here. They better not reach me. Cool, good. Once we get this pin, we might have an actual chance here. He's trying to go for my red a lot. Or my blue. Colors. But, there is fucking minions I do have to take care of, so... Bad spot. He used like all of his abilities there. Oh, he's happy. Take a nap real quick, bud. There you go. Not too much kill potential right now. Alright, let's push this under. He just backed. Maybe, just maybe I can do something here with this. Oh, dude, it went right between. I'm trying to hit both of them. Smalls in the very least. Oh, oh, holy shit. You know, like, the probability of actually doing that is really low. Oh, boy. Thorn second relic? Maybe. Just maybe, man. Dude, that's so awful. Shell for the detonate. Or we can also shell the ultimate. Uh, not too sure. I kind of like the idea of thorns, though. Because I'm gonna get up really close to him, and as you saw there, I'm gonna be taking a lot of damage. 
All the burst damage and shit, and thorns might be it. I don't know, he's going double protection, so probably not. Oh well, too late. Then my friends have disappeared along with all possible chats and smite. Yeah, my lobby chat broke earlier. Oh, that's smite, dude. Yeah, that's the thing with Kumba, he only has one damage ability outside of his ultimate. The two does nothing. That's why I don't put points to it. You can be like, yeah, man, you're not putting points to your two, of course it's not gonna do damage, but... Even if you put, I don't know, man, I just don't like it. Whereas if you put points to your three, it scales, you know, duration of the mez, the slow, and attack speed debuff. So, I don't know, man. That's why you kind of need like an E staff, kind of tack on to that damage. Somehow, uh, not miss that entirely. Ooh, that damage, bro. It's my service crashing. It's my favorite. I see there. He's like he's standing really well off to the side, so. I could try to push minions into him, and there's a chance of missing, or if I do hit him, sure does damage to him, but I sacrifice not hitting the entire wave. So. Is two does it root long, or no? It stays at two seconds. And it has like a long ass charge up time, so like, it, it fucking sucks. <laughs> and 1v1s. It really does. Oh boy. Yeah, no, I wish they sped up the, the channel time of it. That'd help uh, come out a lot. More so than 1v1s. When it's like a casual game mode and you have teammates and stuff, you have like setups and, and other players to help you land the two and also the surprise factor. And duel, not so much. Alright. Fuck this dude. Okay. Oh. We actually got him. So that thorns actually helped us get that kill there. But well, I didn't do like an insane amount of damage to him. It did did good enough there to kind of uh, get him there. So he was just a little greedy. I'll take this time to get some tower shots in. It's kind of tough getting tower shots in, so come and get them whenever you can as a guardian. So telegraphed, yeah. All right, I just want to make sure you're back. Probably get these smalls. Not gonna be able to kill them all. No. I don't think I can scare them off or anything. I just kind of have to give it up. Try to rush back. So he's finally going into pen. This is what he really needed. Because he was doing not much damage to me. He went for his blue. I guess he thought I just got red. So here. Um... Everyone went offline and he surrendered? Who knows uh, what this match could have been? Oh, uh, <laughs> uh, The Muslim mobile god trying to invade. Did I get TP? Probably not. Um, hello? I saw what you're bit Whoa!
this dude was so salty that he just F6, dude. We were the same level, I only got first blood gold off of him, but he, that was, he could have won that one so easily, bro. What the fuck? What? <laughs> I, I don't know why he's so fucking salty. Did he thought like I was gonna build E staff and it's the game over, or he thought it was gonna be a gem of ISO, which you don't. What? I, the people of Duel. That's what I deal with. But yeah, I guess GG. I mean, I, the salt just kind of made that so much better. Nice. Um. Uh, we should, uh, where is he at? Recently played. Where is this button, right? Um, harassment. Uh, let's put toxic. I can't really think of anything smart to say. But, uh, hi, Rez, please. Get rid of these. Clean up the streets or put me in charge. Give me a badge, man. I'll take these people down. I'll take them down. 